Uh, the Andrews Institute was started in 1999. Our mission is to work uh, with researchers and with teachers to be able to change the way people think about and work with education as it deals with math and science education. The Andrews Institute helps teachers in different ways at different levels. So at the undergraduate level, we're working with pre-service teachers, and so we're preparing them to go out into the field ultimately and get jobs. And then there's also um, work with teachers that's incorporated with research. The Andrews Institute does most of professional development as long-term professional development. We think that it's very important to work with teachers over a period of time. Our professional development usually is a summer institute followed by um, once a month follow-up sessions during the academic year. My experience with the Andrews Institute has been the best professional development that I've experienced in all of my 13 years of teaching. During the summer, we generally take field trips, which helps really with the content deepening. I have that background knowledge of how the real things work. I've been there, done that, and I think the kids uh, see that as some validity in what I'm saying. They find some value. The benefits are the networking, the people to be able to turn to and see actual education people at the college level that we can go to on a continued basis if we have questions about teaching. It helps us in our craft as far as labs in the classroom, classroom management. Having other teachers that you work with on those Saturdays is really important to share and network information. I was a sixth grade teacher teaching um, sixth grade science and mathematics and came to the Andrews Institute for Professional Development through the teacher quality program in the summer. After my second year with that program, I applied to be a part of the doctoral program and participated for two more years in the professional development while I was attending school part-time and then stopped teaching and joined as a full-time doctoral student. Faculty have been very instrumental in my progress through my doctoral classes. My first experience with the pre-service teachers, I was working as a teaching assistant in a science methods course, so I was able to observe Dr. Weinberg teach pre-service teachers um, those science methods for elementary teaching. And then I had opportunities twice in two different semesters to teach pre-service teachers science content. I was the professor on record for those courses, so they, it was my content and my curriculum worked in with the syllabus that had been used in the past. Um, I had the opportunity to really develop a class as a doctoral student and get that experience. When we do research or professional development, we want it to be ongoing. So I think one of our goals is to create leaders that go out there in the schools, and then even though we might not be leading the professional development, they have built the capacity to carry on that work so that we can start as a really small institute, but we can grow by building those collaborations and having that, having that continue outside of TCU and the institute. The Andrews Institute reaches out to content specialists to help with our outreach so that teachers are hearing about um, biology and chemistry and physics from professors in those departments. In addition, we reach out to the greater communities. The Andrews Institute has been terrific in helping to sponsor many of the projects here at Starpoint. They have a one program they put on every year is, is a program where the kids come from all over the area and they include Starpoint students to do things like different kinds of science experiments and they do it all over the campus they have things set up and the kids really really enjoy that. Every summer we draw in oh, I don't know 30, 40 teachers they come from all over the area and also uh, some homeschool type teachers also and they learn the program and the building and things like that. So now they can take it back to their students and teach them. The Andrews Institute is affecting change in science and mathematics education through this teacher development. When we're attending conferences and participating in discussions regarding research and, and teaching, we know that we've been well prepared. The one thing I always have to add is how much we appreciate the endowment from Paul and Judy Andrews, and it is through their gracious endowment that we're able to do scholarships for our doctoral students and our master's students, and it's through their uh, generous gift that we can do free professional development for teachers and the outreach that we do for children, so we do not charge for anything that we do in the Institute. We create teacher leaders, whether it's through our undergraduate program, our graduate programs, or through our professional development, and then they go out there and then they continue on the work 
of the Institute.